Hi, my name is Andrew Mohama. I'm a clinical assistant that works here at Korean Dermatology, and I'm here to tell you just a little bit about my experience with Dysport and Botox in the armpits. Uh, so for all of my life, I've suffered uh, from hyperhidrosis, which is extreme and excessive sweating from the underarms. It can happen in other places, but for me, it was in the underarms. Um, so for a long time, I really struggled with this. I would have to go to the bathroom in between classes to wipe underneath. Um, long story short, it was uncomfortable. Um, I tried a bunch of different stuff, ranging from topical stuff to oral things, and nothing really did the trick for me. So after some time, I finally looked into getting Botox um, or Dysport injections. Um, I used to get Botox injections about every six months, and those worked really well. The most recent I had here from Dr. Tureen uh, was the Dysport injections, and those have worked phenomenally for me. Um, it's really helped me a lot in terms of not being as self-conscious about my underarms, uh, I'm really not sweating much anymore at all. Uh, I even recently traveled to the Middle East where it's much warmer than it is here in Minnesota and I still did not experience any issues with sweating in the underarms. Um, I would beg to say probably 90 to 95% reduced sweating in the underarms um, and I'm really, really satisfied with it. It's made me much happier, much more confident um, and I would definitely recommend Dysport uh, or Botox to anyone who is considering treating their hyperhidrosis. Hi, my name is Dr. Mohiba Tureen. I'm a board certified dermatologist and I practice here in Roseville, Minnesota, Faribault, and soon to be in Maplewood. This is my wonderful colleague, Andrew. Andrew is an amazing young man who um, suffers from a condition called hyperhidrosis where he produces excessive sweat under his armpit areas and that can be detrimental to his quality of life because A, it causes excessive sweating, B, he gets staining, and C, it's a little uncomfortable. So what we're doing for him today is something called Dysport. It's an injection of a toxin. It helps reduce that hyperactivity of the sweat glands. It's awesome. It'll last typically anywhere between six to nine, even 12 months. I typically will preferentially use Dysport rather than Botox for this area because of its longevity. So Andrew's been numbing for a little bit just with numbing cream. I'm going to mark the areas. So sometimes we do something called a starch iodide test where we actually put like a little bit of powder to see where Andrew sweats the most. But I can also see that with my numbing cream. So if you zoom in, you can see this is the concentration. You can see where the numbing cream has really has come out. So that's where he sweats the most. But this at the periphery is also where he sweats a little bit. So we're going to concentrate there and then go outwards. This is my colleague, Rachel. She's our cosmetic director. She's going to be assisting me. If you can massage Andrew's other shoulder, please. Ready, Andrew, dear? Yep. So Andrew's going to his happy place. Again, just to reiterate, I'm going to begin in the um, area of the highest concentration of the sweat glands. Ready, Andrew? See, again, he's pretty symmetric. That's where we can see the um, concentration of the sweat glands the most, so I'm really gonna hone in there. Ready, dear? Rachel's mm -hmm. just massaging the other side. Some insurances cover this procedure, some do not. Out of pocket, how much do we choose, charge right now, Rachel? It is $950 to do one area, which would be classified as the full underarms for both. So we charge between nine to 1200 for the area, and it will last between six to 12 months.